What is up guys, man? Crytek Sword in here. And pretty much today's video is a continuation on my latest one about last gen fading away. Now, first off, before you know I continue on more, I just want to say that I'm sorry for not being able to upload. You know, if you guys follow me on Twitter, you guys would know that my computer kind of broke, got messed up. I'm trying to get a new one. Finances are pretty tough right now, so I'm doing the best I can. But thank you for sitting there uh, and supporting, staying around. So, with that being said, guys, uh, let me pretty much give a recap. I was going through my Game Informer, uh, issue 263 of March, and pretty much I seen an article about them t talking about, is this the last of, uh, the last gen? And, you know, I want to put my opinion on that, and I wouldn't say, you know, it's the last breath to say, but I do see it pretty much declining. And what I mean by that is, they're making all these new games, the developers are using new engines, you know, we're gonna have, um, Frostbite 5, I mean, yeah, pretty soon, right, Frostbite 5. Anyways, whatever, uh, a lot of new engines, uh, Unreal 4 engine, so, they're producing wicked, wicked amounts of graphics, and with that being said, obviously, you're gonna need new console, new hardware, to add up with that uh new engine i mean it makes sense so the last uh consoles the 360 and ps3 they don't have the hardware to meet the standards so that that's where that pretty much comes into play is last gen fading out and i would say pretty much yes it is i mean it's going by really slowly but then yet it's gonna go by pretty quick i know that's kind of confusing but within a year i believe that you know, it will be pointless having having this. At well, at the end of this year, it will be pointless having the 360 and PS3. I mean, the the games coming out are like wicked. Just Cause 3, like I mentioned before, Fallout 4 pretty soon. Uh, Battlefront, Star Wars Battlefront. So you know, games like that they won't be on the last gen. They're gonna be on next gen and PC. I mean, that's what's just gonna happen. That's that. So, it, it also seems like Microsoft and Sony is just slowly pushing those consoles away. I mean, Microsoft, what they're doing, um, pretty much doing a team up, I would like to say, with uh, Windows 10, Xbox One. And I love it. It's beautiful. When I first seen the um, conference, it was like phenomenal. Being able to play with PC players, having the Xbox One games on your computer, it is perfect. That is just wow. So that is awesome, and then I don't know what Sony has up their sleeve, but I do know they have the Project Morpheus, which is the VR, and speaking of which, Microsoft has the HoloLens, which is pretty much up to reality as well. So I mean, stuff like this, I mean, they're not going to be able uh, to cooperate with the last gen, and virtual reality is going to be a hell of a thing for uh, 2015, I believe, and I'm just waiting for that, I can't wait for that to come out. And it might not seem all that much, but just it's just the little stuff that you won't be able to do. And plus, we're all gonna ha we're all gonna have the new features coming to consoles in the near future. So I mean, we'd love to have those too. So just a lot of stuff like that. It just it just sucks not having the ability to play games or even try out the new features on new consoles. So. From my perspective, I do think that the last gen is pretty much fading out, and to be honest, I really only see the um, the new Call of Duties coming out for the for the last gen. Not really much major games, but mostly Call of Duties. That's pretty much it. And it sucks because you know when GTA 5 came out for the next gen, it was like Rockstar. Can you put V um not VR, uh, first person on the 360 but the hardware couldn't handle it but that's pretty much that guys um i want to hear your input in the comment section below do you think last gen's fading and will you be getting the next gen if so once more again let me know in the comment section below and follow me on twitter to keep up with updates and everything else until then guys i'll see you guys in the next video crytex out